Okay guys, as promised, here is the little vampire that I created. Um, here are his legs, his toes, they're very pink. There's some more toes. Here's this foot right here. And here is that foot. And there's some veining and mottling there. And this hand. Mottling. This hand. You can see right there. I did painted hair on him. My first attempt actually on painted hair. And there are his eyebrows. Let's see, it's a lot of light hitting him. There's his other eyebrow. Um, I hand sculpted his fangs with polymer clay and carefully applied them on so they are definitely adhered on and won't come off unless you really I guess hit them or knock them off or drop him in some kind of way but um, here he is <laughs> good smile um, he does have a lot of purpley undertone um, a little a gray hue to him so he is small newborn so Carter's small newborn um, is his size um, you can see his ears on the side and on the side but yeah I, it was a lot of fun um, to create him and just be creative with this little guy. Um, I really enjoyed sculpting the little teeth. This is the second, actually the third vampire I've made. The first original vampire I made, if you guys go way back to my videos, you'll see. Um, I made him out of a bountiful baby kit and that's what really got me on the path of rewarding. Then the second vampire my friend Dana owns and I love that little vamp. And now this little guy. So. He will be available, or he is available for adoption. Um, and I thought only to ask $100 for him. That basically just covers the materials um, for this guy. So if anybody is wanting a little vampire, you know, Halloween is right around the corner. Um, you're more than likely to have him in your home and adopt him and um, have him out dis on display and change his little outfits every year um, or have him out all year round you know you know I didn't make him where he is too scary looking or um, where it would frighten anybody if you have small children or you know you just want to lightly tip your toes into the monster babies um, he would be a good starter baby to have but um yeah i just thought i would share him with you guys i think he came out really nice um and i will be making some more in the future he is being shown right now with natural daylight hitting him um it's coming from my window so nothing is edited i don't have a ring light on or anything like that this is his true color and if i close the blinds See how dark it is. I mean, that's how he looks with the vines closed. But like I said, he has a lot of mottling, veining, splotchiness in the skin. Um, he's just a cute guy, cute little fella. There we go. Open up the window again. So yeah, you're interested. Um, I will send a link below where you can contact me through Instagram. Um, I will only ship in the United States. Sorry for those are overseas. Um, international is just not for me right now. But uh, in the US, yeah, it'll be $100. And then 
we can discuss shipping when um, you contact me. But yeah, he is so stinking cute. And he's going to be a lot of fun. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Bye.